Protesto. When Andres Manuel López Obrador was sworn into office on December 1st, tens of thousands of cheering fans welcomed him. And the Mexican president's honeymoon isn't over yet. On Monday, López Obrador celebrated his first 100 days in office, and with the most recent survey putting his approval rating at 78 percent, his first three months in power have been the most popular since polling began in the 1980s. El gobierno the government belongs to all Mexicans, and its main function is to enforce justice and seek the welfare and happiness of the people. López Obrador has broken with tradition by offering daily press conferences that start at 7 a.m., by repeatedly bringing up corruption, equality, development and his own popularity, the veteran politician has been able to set Mexico's news agenda. We will continue, all of us, together, to build a beautiful utopia. We will continue moving towards the great ideal of living in a new, free, fair, democratic and fraternal homeland. López Obrador has already made good on many of his most popular campaign promises. The folksy leader has cut back government salaries, given up presidential luxuries and launched a myriad of social programs while traversing the country. Most Mexicans are enamored by López Obrador's brand of populist politics, but critics warn that he doesn't have concrete plans to bring about change at a critical time for the country. January marked Mexico's most violent month on record with nearly 3,000 murders. And the country's economy could be in trouble, with investment down by 6% in December, the biggest drop in more than five years. Good intentions is not enough to change the reality of a daily life, both on the economic and the security front. There needs to be a plan. Uh, there needs to be more reforms on different fronts to increase productivity and economic growth potential. That is not in, at least at the beginning of the administration during his first 100 days, there doesn't seem to be a plan to do that. For now, López Obrador is able to blame previous administrations for the country's problems. But as he heads further into his presidency, the Mexican people will hold him to account for his political leadership and his efforts to tackle the challenges the country faces. David Mercer, Al Jazeera, Mexico City.